What's this fucking pop up here? Oh, for fuck's sake. Get out of the way. Right, I've just uh, had to turn the Wi-Fi on the uh, smartphone so I could resharpen the focus on the interfered with front webcam. I uh, couldn't record it while I was doing that uh, because it wouldn't let me on the smone open two tabs at the same time to record while I was refocusing it. But some, someone or something's been messing about with the front cam while trying to uh, intimidate with the uh, slamming door noises. You know, just like the uh, threat of court door slamming. Anyway, I found out where it's coming from and I caught it before it stopped recording on the last video I recorded. So I'm now going to show you what this computer is doing at the moment right that's where the door slamming was coming from that house there and a white car that just drove away from there yeah this isn't there to spy on them but for my own peace of mind when I hear that door slamming outside the front of the property because of what happened with the police the other day. Currently, as you can see, I'm laying on my bed with a towel covering my butt, which is why I checked. Right? Curtains are shut. All curtains in the house are shut for my own privacy cameras are there for my own security and protection as the landlords are fully aware but a certain clique of neighbours have got a issue with the local council putting non local families in this area in these bungalows and they don't like that because they want this place for their families in this village. Right, just going to have a quick pan up the road. I can see the shining on the road there from the fallen rain as well as on the path there. Just going to have a quick pan up the road and then log out the camera. It's not there to spy on the cameras, just for my own peace of mind and security. Right audience next door not got a problem with him listening at all but i'll just watch what i say now because i know why he's there and what he's been manipulated into doing no other problems in the road except you know the threats and the intimidation and the silly mind games and all that other nonsense and the illegal home entries every time i nip out for whatever uh, whether it be just to go to the local garage, keep catching them out, come back. Um, right, I'm not going to, yeah, I am going to record this just to prove a point from yesterday, right? About ice cream, of all things. Right, I'm not going to, uh, I'll just remove the towel as I uh, put a bit of pair of boxer shorts on so I'm going to put the phone down for a minute while I do that but I'll leave it recording yeah <sighs> clicking in right knee still Stretch and manipulate the knee joint, which is clicking in left knee. Let me show you. Let's get some light on the situation. This is me checking myself, right? Doing a bit of stretching exercise. 
Oh, let's have a bit of light in here. Right. Let me try and balance the phone on my chin without swatching, without stopping the recording. Can't see what I'm doing properly, but hopefully I'm doing it gently enough. The clicking's coming from that side of the knee. Right. Now the plum in my mouth on the left side of my jaw from the dentistry that's not being done on the NHS because of the government fraud. Right, I can see on the TV there's a cat, uh, motorbike going away, but they're decent people. I've, uh, you know, I talk to them up the shop. There's no problem with them people. Nice people. <clears throat> I don't know if this can be seen properly because I don't, I can't see the uh, front cam on the phone because I'm not interested in taking selfies. Hopefully you should be able to see it. Nothing in the jaw to create a false impression of what's going on on the outside of the face there. It's definitely swollen. Like I said, I'm just looking at the ceiling, moving the camera angle about so you can see it. I don't know if it's actually pointing at it or not, but if I touch it at the moment, there's no pain on that bit of the jaw. Right. Tooth has completely snapped off. Tooth has completely snapped off. Exposed nerve underneath the tooth. I'm uh, having to, I don't want to manipulate it at the moment because either the abscess is going to explode or it's going to start severe pain off in my face as well and I've already got enough of that going on with my knee, my uh, right ankle, everything else. So I don't want to aggravate that as well. Right. Let's log out the camera first, just for the neighbour's peace of mind after resetting the focus. What's the date and time like on the camera? Twenty ninth for the ninth, twenty twenty one, fifteen oh two, three oh two p.m. on the computer as well. All good on that front, except that it got reset, which took it out of focus. Which I didn't change because it's not there to spy on the neighbours, so I don't need to see any faces, do I? Just what's bothering me with the. Uh, door slamming and the threats and the intimidation that's not working at all as you saw from when the police came here because something and someone is manipulating that whole situation right let's log out of it refocus hang on a second let's just uh, point it back to my front door first and show you proof Refocused on door, approach, and entry point to the front door. As the camera's intended to be. Right, and it's in focus. It's not there to spy on the neighbours to look at any of those houses or anything else. 
it has no capability of looking in people's bedroom windows or anything stupid like that. Okay, right, logging out. Logged out. Right, logged out. See, I don't need to be looking at the camera all the time spying on people, do I? Just, it's there for my own peace of mind and security to catch out the people playing the fucking mind games that's pissing me off. Right, don't need to be doing anything on there at the moment. I don't need to log into the back cam, which has also been reset and interfered with, because that's not there to... Uh, interfere with or spy on the back neighbours either and I know it's going to be pointed that way because that's its reset angle right so it's not pointed anywhere because I haven't reset it myself yet because it's I'm doing that for a browser right right Two different company names because I wanted to see who was messing about with what. Right, data feeds just uploading. Right. Due to the current measures in place over this whatever it is when I try to contact the people to get them to show me how to record and have it sent directly to my email oh sorry we can't do that at the moment due to the blah 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 excuse you have to phone the uh, company's headquarters in America which was where that green flag just came from, that area. Right? Okay, got me so far. This is how I do the Earthquake 3D. Quick spin round, so I can follow the Earthquake pattern because I was taught that way that quickly. Um. All right, what we got going on here? I saw this little stack there on... Uh, yeah, it's only stuck on today's, yeah? So, last 24 hours. Not interested in last week or whatever at the moment because I'm only focused on the threat to the UK, if there is one. Set on view two. I'll just show you the different things there. That's your basic. Two is what I usually have it focused on because it gives you a, a reasonable impression of the world. View three. View four. View five. Gives you the plate tectonic boundary lines which you can follow and work out the pattern yourself. View 6 gives you all the angles that the energy is coming out from the core. Whether they're deep energy coming out, whether it's shallow energy coming out. So you're looking through the globe. Which all gets grounded into. Yes, got me on that. Right, let's go back to view 2. That self popped up because I've got a very sensitive mouse on the thingy here, look. So let's just click back on that. Um. <coughs> view 
view edit let's move that right over so we can see the size of the actual earthquake rings right now I'm focusing back on the area that I've been logging and learning about Canary Islands I'm showing you what I've written on my Facebook profile so far today yeah Iceland the volcano um, spikes will pop up in a minute on this application as well showing if there's a volcano erupting and if there's a volcano erupting now I'll show you that in a minute um, feeds USGS USA seven day active volcano Smithsonian Institute weekly report EMSC world last 50 EMSC Euro mid last 50 EMSC world last 50 BGS 30 day NRCAN 30 day I don't click on any other links because it's not important to me at the moment and this computer is not a top-notch gaming computer so I'm having to just focus on the area that family are in right that's why it's like that right at some point they will show the volcano spikes when it uh, updates the feeds and that let's go on the browser quickly check the BGS see if there's any change on that yet this is how I keep my hyperactive mind occupied constructively rather than focusing on nonsense and games and psychology that people can manipulate it with right BGS first BGS no change let's get out of that government link or crown link whatever it is Iceland link where is it whole country This is the Iceland link. Warning, an eruption ongoing at, can't pronounce it, that volcano that I've been showing on the live stream. Note, most recent SO2, SO4 gas dispersion forecast is accessible here. So I'll just show you these links work because historically, a gas cloud from Iceland swept over the UK killing thousands if that is a true account of history low is a text forecast for our gas pollution from the blah 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 right so I'm not trained in all of that currently wind directions going that way not towards the UK Right, that's direct from the Iceland Met Office. They can only calculate these observations if they have the information correctly posted on the BGS because they need to know what energy is coming from all angles to make these assessments. Which is why I said, don't mess about with the data, do it properly. Okay. You know that's true off of this even though I don't have the uh, arrows on the same globe which can be done by installing the arrows myself on here on this app 
I just haven't yet, but I've got it stored on the computer. Ready to be done. Transferring feed data. Let's put my glasses on, it's making me squint. Just laying down resting here like this. Let's get my hair out like. Right. Oh, what we got here. Let's have a look back a bit. So today we've got A pretty calm grease and I'm only seeing one earthquake at the volcano 2.6 and a 3.5 in Iceland which is the one that could be a problem that one the winds heading that way isn't it up towards there where there's a big underwater caldera now if that one goes at the Canary Islands and Iceland's already active as well, you've got another caldera further up here on the Mid-Atlantic Ridge which could be the kill shot. So that's why I'm watching it. Not panicking because uh, you know that, that sort of thing's already happened once in history before I think and uh, that's my personal view anyway, but, you know. The caldera is up here somewhere. I think someone who discovered it named it Mount Dutch, but it's a huge underwater caldera. Check the weather data feeds. Come on, move. That's it. So that's why I'm focused there only. With all the distractions, sleep deprivation from the pain and the stress. Right, let's have a get out of that one quickly. Weather satellite feed. Right, and we know that the Iceland volcano one's going that way, the wind at the moment, with the gas in it, yeah? Rain radar. I'm not clicking on the cookies because I don't need to. It says I'm in... Kirby Muxlow. Oh well, but if I click on the cookies or add my location, it would zone right in on that location. Right, I don't need to do that because I'm only looking. Timestamp in BST.
never seen those yellow marks before. Don't know what that is. There's some around the UK as well. Don't know what they are. I can see one in Holland there as well. One down there. So something's been marked out there for some reason. It's not a colour on the... Uh, It's not a colour issue on the application, is it? What's in that area? That's Isle of Wight area, isn't it? Big naval base, that area. And it's been marked out on this map. Something up here they've marked out as well. Oh well. Let's get out of that one. You know how I use YouTube. <laughs> this guy's funny. Let's have a quick distraction now of uh They aren't afraid of scary clowns, eh? <laughs> Brilliant little lioness. It's only humour, isn't it? Might freak other people out, but. I find it funny while all this nonsense is going on around me. If they spy in and see it and go, ooh, what the fuck's this? You know, why now? It's a distraction, isn't it? A good distraction, though. Builds up a picture for them to uh, focus on. Doesn't it? Bit like doing this. Oops. Oops. Let's just put that back on there. Because you can see the wording in the background there, can't you? Yeah, but you can't see the anonymous mask or the words of encouragement. Because that's private. But everybody else wants to know, don't they? So, I'm not buying a uh, black car, am I? <coughs> I don't, uh, you know, want that. But, Unfortunately, if you want anything decent in life, you need the publicity to do it, don't you? Three point five. Where's that Northern Italy? Right. Locking up from leaning on my front. <sighs> Just showing proof, not the actual letter. Don't know if that's how it was sent 
or not. Okay. Letter on keeping safe for my son. Sent as a care address letter to this property. Haven't opened it, that's how it's been in my pocket. Right, it's getting a bit tatty around the edges where it's been sitting in my pocket safe, but it's unopened because it's not my not my details, not my business. Right, that's my son Jack's letter. Who doesn't live here? Right, but the corners come open. I haven't looked, tried to peek inside it or nothing. Right. Kept safe in my pocket, along with that one. On me, so people can't sneak in here and find out about private business. Now you know I'll be exposing it all. Not stories. Ugh. Right, so we can see what all that's about. Bit by bit, getting there, working around disability. Let's have that off to save the gas because I don't know what's going on with my disability at the moment so I haven't touched the bank account. Let's get this in the oven and reheat it. This is the leftovers from last night. But it gives me something to do while I've got to slowly go through all of the uh, cleaning up. I've only washed up what I need to eat from, left the rest. Well, I'll focus on my health. All right, that's the last of the casserole what I was eating last night. That needs washing up. Washing up I'll do in a minute when I've finished recording and upload all these videos. Yeah, look, I don't clean all the cupboards up. My back's hurting leaning over. Right, let's use this one now. Uh, or shall I use a smaller container? Don't want to risk the Pyrex dish exploding because it's cold in the... Uh... Hang on, no, it doesn't matter, I can use that. It's clean. Um, a gift for how 